Yo, what's going on guys? I'm Jay Carter Ray and in this video I'm going to be discussing the South Park Fractured Butthole <laughs> Gameplay Showcase. Now, I only just recently um, realised that it's, it's the Fractured Butthole. Like, <laughs> these guys are just, you know, toilet humour at the wazoo, man. They're out here. But, um... Yeah, I watched the, the gameplay showcase. Well, really, I watched a couple, you know, trailers, a couple individual videos before I actually realised that they had featured them all in the gameplay showcase. As I said before, I didn't actually watch E3. I've just been watching, you know, specific segments of the things that I wanted to watch because I don't have the time to just sit down and watch, you know, three hours of someone showcasing some shit. So, let me talk about South Park, The Stick of Truth. Now... I was excited for South Park The Stick of Truth, even though I completely hate turn-based combat. I hate it. I completely hate it. Like, I just don't like it whatsoever. It's just lame to me. Like It's just really crap. And I I got South Park The Stick of, the Stick of Truth because I enjoy South Park and I know that yeah they were going to include you know south park writing and it was going to be hilarious and fun and all the reviews said it was hilarious and funny and that sort of shit so obviously the reviews and you know my own love for south park persuaded me to play the game now i think i completed the game in like two days it wasn't very long uh, there wasn't a lot of content in there and I'm assuming that, you know, this uh, the Fractured Butthole um, game is going to be the same, basically. It's not going to have a lot of content, but the content that it does have will be extremely hilarious, extremely fun. You'll always want to get to the next point because it's, it's just like an episode of South Park. And obviously this time they're, they're going with the, the superhero um, theme, which is great. I love it when they do the Coon and Friends theme. Um, it's always hilarious and they're like having a civil war <laughs> which is hilarious in itself like they're taking the piss out of marvel um so i'm really you know i i don't know if i'm excited for this like if if i was gonna get it for free i'd be excited for it but i doubt i'm gonna buy this um i think it comes out this year I'm unsure what date it comes out as of now, but yeah, I'll probably leave the date in the description or title. But I, I think it's coming out like they, late this year, like December or November, one of them times. So I doubt I'm going to get it. Doubt I'm going to get it because as far as I know, it's only going to be two days of gameplay. So that's that. That's what keeps me from purchasing this game. And um, they have upgraded the fighting system, but you know the fighting system was crappy to begin with. So. Is still turn-based, but you can move about a little bit. So that's that's not really making me be like, oh, that's amazing. It's just like, okay, it's a crappy combat system that you made a bit less crappy. So I'm not excited about that. All, all the only reason I'd get this game is for the South Park story and for the experience, not for the gameplay. Maybe for the you know making your own character and that sort of customization and that sort of shit. But it's still the South Park experience. That's what you're coming into this game for. So I doubt I'm going to get this game, but it does look very interesting and I want to know if you guys are looking to get it. Let me know if you liked the Stick of Truth also because it would be interesting if you like, like that and you're looking to get this. Or if you didn't like that and you're looking to get this, leave your comments down below. Also be sure to hit that like button if you haven't done so already and hit that subscribe button as I'll be putting out loads more videos. If you want to check out the rest of my trailer reviews and E3 commentary, you can click on the playlist on the screen and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. It's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long So all this warmth I share with you